Hey everybody, what's going on? It's your boy Takedown Man, back with another episode. And on this episode, we're going to talk about Area 51 Alien Archives. Um, is what this site was. This site used to be a really badass site that I guess they were with Freedom Hosting. So they had to, you know, they didn't have a choice. It got shut down whenever Freedom Hosting got shut down. However, it was probably one of the most comprehensive sites as far as aliens, UFOs, and so forth. Um, it was a lot more informative than Hat Canada or saying and all that. So, um, I think it would be, it's going to be a really good website whenever it comes back up. They are rebuilding it as we speak. And it should be back up within a month. So I'm going to put the link up there so we can actually save the link. So that way you can come back to it and get it later on for whenever it is up. I would say just keep checking on it and see, you know, whenever they put the site live and so on. Because it was a very cool site and I really enjoyed it. This one right here is called Burnout. And is what Burnout is, it's basically a site that has like different wars, stuff like that. Um, different links to different things. And it gives you warnings on some of them. Just kind of like the Facebook tour down here. You know, it says that it requires a mobile number or legal documentation of your identity, which is kind of stupid seeing how the whole point of being on tour is being a non as Facebook. So, Mark Zuckerberg, you need to do something about that. If you're making it to keep people's identities hidden, then maybe you should keep people's identities hidden. Like people in China, Korea, North Korea, and so forth. They can't use this. So, uh, yeah, I would say that's a bad idea. Last but not least is Shadow Life. And Shadow Life talks about everything that you can think of under the sun. It, you know, if you look at the tags and stuff, it has things like algorithm, um, algorithms, anonymity, anarchy, um, digital tradecraft, encryption, physical trademark, surveillance tradecraft. I mean, it's, it's just a lot of stuff on here. And there are a lot of categories and a lot of articles about different things on the deep web and about different things just in general um, about your privacy, about different passport checks, different things that the government's doing and so forth. So it always gives you a head up, guys. And there ain't nothing wrong with that. And um, I mean, as you can see, it really does have a lot of stuff on there. So let's see here. It's got categories on this side, archives on this side. So I'm going to try to click a category and hopefully, hope my internet works fast enough to get it up here in a minute. Hopefully the announcements will come up. I'm saying it is. Alright, there we go. So that's just the announcement page and so forth. Oh, I don't like this. It's take down. <laughs> but yeah basically the links do work so either way guys the links will be in the description and um, you know as always guys I always use caution whenever going on any deep website okay um, make sure you're not trying to buy anything or download anything because things are getting really really sticky on the deep web here anymore and if it's illegal activity well you guys already know man they are cracking and tracking and doing everything they can to find out, you know, who all's doing what. So, either way, guys, this is your boy Takedown Man saying thanks so much for watching. You guys have a great day. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Peace out, guys.